what's up everybody i'm jamie welcome back to my channel and today what i have is the um monthly collab with the makeup mafia and um this month we decided to do like um thanksgiving inspired look um which is kind of almost just like a fall inspired look i'd say um i'm gonna put some tape on my eyes here um <clears throat> we're just gonna do this nice and um simple look uh pretty much like an every you could use it as an everyday look um there's no rules in makeup you can wear what you want when you want you can wear whatever you want whenever you want you know <clears throat> okay so like i just got up so if i clear my throat a lot that's why <laughs> okay so i got the tape on because i just want to get um some really angular <clears throat> on my eyes and sometimes when i'm doing it with just freehand it don't get as good as i'd like it to um for some reason <clears throat> Um, I get a lot of patchiness in my um, eyes and I think it's just my skin it's not the palettes it, it's just my skin and also I got another hair color this is really pretty because it's like ash and I got all the red out that's basically what I was doing with my hair in the first place I wanted all the red out and this will get lighter right here as I wash it and this is dark so I think it looks really good what do you guys think but anyways I'm gonna be using the Natasha Denona <clears throat> Um, peak palette. It's the one that we got in our boxy charm. I actually got two in mine. I got this one and I got this one. Beauty Creations. So, I mean, I'm just going to use this one. I know Kimberly is using this one too. Like I said before, I swear me and Kimberly have the same thoughts. <laughs> it's so crazy. But yeah, this is really beautiful, especially for like a fall type thanksgiving look what i'm gonna do is go into this brown here kind of lightly sorry if you can hear my dogs oh they want me to come out i'm busy i'm just gonna start out here because i want it winged out you know lightly and kind of just go in like so so if you got boxy charm you can follow this tutorial if you want I'm not saying I'm the best at makeup, but I do pretty good for myself, you know? <clears throat> I work with what I have, girl. That's all I know. So, yeah. And I just make sure I get a lot right there by the tape. And just kind of go in like that. And like I said, when when it looks patchy, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's just my skin. Because I have never had something that was really smooth. This is... <clears throat> Pretty nice. I'm gonna color switch that brush here and I'm gonna go in with this white one. I know they have names, but I always botch it. Like I say them backwards because I think on the back they're on backwards. I'm not really sure. But I'm gonna blend that out so it won't look so patchy. But mine usually always look patchy. Not sure why. I'm I'm pretty much sure it's my skin. So it is what it is. I kind of have more porous skin. I know you can't really tell on camera. In in real life, you can kind of tell, but yeah, it's kind of porous. And we'll repeat the other, same exact thing on the other eye. I'll fast forward you. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go in with a little bit of the orange here. Let me get a smaller brush here. I'm just using <laughs> the BH Cosmetics um, Royal Affair um, brushes. I'm gonna go into this orange and I'm gonna kind of put it right here. 
kind of blend it into the brown and hopefully this looks goes with a green shirt because I'm wearing kind of like a, a army type green shirt kind of just go like that with it this is a beautiful palette like <laughs> I'm so happy that I got it <clears throat> I couldn't believe I got two of them. I was like, what? Because there's been times where I didn't get none and I was like, excuse me? I collect palettes, so <laughs> I need my palette fix. I think that looks pretty good. And then I'm going to take the shimmer and put it on the inside, you know? A regular old look that anybody could do and real pretty for fall and for thanksgiving gosh i can't believe it's almost the end of the year thank god get this year over with y'all i can't do it anymore it hasn't been that bad for me but as the world in general it's not been very good so i can't wait until it's just 2021 what do you guys think i'm gonna do some blending so it looks so harsh right here and hopefully that'll look better. I'm not gonna blend too much into the shimmer shade so I don't blend it all away. But yeah, I know that's one thing I always known that I need to work on is my blending skills. Um, yeah, uh, but at least I acknowledge that I know <laughs> that I need to work on it. <laughs> but I feel like if I sit here and blend forever, you guys will be like, girl, you are boring. I am out. <laughs> But I think that looks pretty good. And if I didn't say before, I have my foundation, um, concealer, and eyebrows on. And powder. Um, I had to figure out what to put on my eyebrows since I got a different hair color again. So that's a whole thing, girl. It's a whole thing. And I think I pretty much use all but this shade. And I'm going to take this shade and put it on the bottom. <clears throat> Oh yeah, this um, brush that I got out of BoxyCharm, the Moda, it's like triangle, actually. It's really good for in here, like really good. Since it has that triangle and you can get right in there. So I'll just add more. How did I get this right here? Oh, the tape probably ended right there. But, and then I'll kind of blend out <clears throat> the edges of this. But I'm gonna put this on the bottom, whoops. I'm just going to sweep it underneath. Hopefully it's, I think it's going on. I don't know. I'm trying to look at, at you guys and put it on. Okay, so I'm going to get a brush again. I kind of want a dense brush, but I don't know if I really have any in here. Maybe I'll use the triangle one again. And just kind of blend the edge. And the edges of that so it doesn't look so harsh. And I'm gonna put on some eyeliner. I'm gonna use the Araceli. up my eyeliner so I'm gonna let it dry and I'm just I'm gonna put some more over it that's how I fix things <laughs> sorry if that's not how you do it I don't have time to take this all off if you know what I'm saying Just kind of slap a band-aid on it. <laughs> and then I'm gonna take some um, cream gel liner by ColourPop and put it in the waterline on top and bottom. It doesn't 
doesn't look too bad, right? And then the rest of the makeup. I've been using this for weeks now. So Kat Von D Shade and Light. And um, I have this brush. It looks pretty cool. I like this brush actually. But like 90% of my brushes are dirty. So that's kind of, kind of sucks. I gotta clean them. I don't know when I'm gonna clean them. So we'll see. Seems like I got too much right here. And it'll be hard to get off because I got, maybe if I take the lighter pieces. No, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. And um, I, mascara. I don't know about this um, brow color with this hair, but I'm, I don't know. I think it's okay. It's fine, right? My hair looks a lot more healthy with this color in. Um, with blonde, my hair just, it does not do well. It always looks so gross. And I know I look good as a blonde, but my hair just doesn't like it, girl. It does not like it. And you're probably sick of seeing this, but this is my favorite highlighter pretty much of all time. Ofra's Glazed Donut by Ofra and Nick, Nikki Tutorials. <clears throat> so I'm gonna just, I'll just take a big, see that's pretty, huh? Like my favorite. Should I put on blush? Yeah, let's put on blush. Um, I'm gonna take, and this should tie in with thick. This e.l.f. blush with, um, uh, I'm not sure what it's called. Always punchy. I don't see why they can't put it bigger like that. They got it really tiny right here, the primer infused blush. They can put the name bigger so you can see it. But I'm just gonna put right here. I feel like my skin's so white, like, I gotta put so, I don't know why I gotta put so much on. Because it's so white, so why do I have to? Okay, and then we'll take a spritz of the Tarte Miracle Mist. And then I dry. It's a mess down here. I kind of cleaned it up yesterday, but. So I'm gonna get a lip color and then we should be good to go. I'm gonna go with the Lex Velvet and you can't even by ColourPop. I feel like all these colors go really well together and I didn't really even plan it. Something actually came together in my life. Wow. Okay, so this is the finished look. If you like this look, make sure you go down below in my description box and follow all the makeup mafia ladies. We got <clears throat> Nona, Chip, Kimberly, and Miss Sherry, and they will be doing the same look. Um, they're my wonderful friends. I love them so much, and we haven't been talking that much lately. I miss them. I love them. Um, make sure you go down and follow them, and their channels are wonderful, and they are wonderful. So make sure you follow my social media, and that's all she wrote for today. Thank you for watching. Bye. <laughs>